Despicable 3! Excited! Safari's so good. Good morning everyone. And this is our last time at Animal Kingdom and we've got three fast passes for Flight of Passage, Everest and Dinosaur. We were going to stay for Rivers of Light but the more and more I've thought about it I think we're just going to give it a swerve. We're planning on going to Disney Springs this afternoon and then washing, laundry, yay! What are you most excited for? Flight of Passage oh, and yeah. Everest. Yeah, Jimmy loves Everest. And I'm excited to get closer as a girl again in What are you excited passage. for? To get to a girl again in Fire Passage. You always get a girl avatar, don't you? Yeah, I don't get it, but I'm always a girl. What sauce do you have on a burger at Animal Kingdom? Hakuna tomato. Whee! I don't really think it's a sauce, is it? Tomato sauce? Uh, Akuna, tomato, Akuna, tomato. Must it have been a good one. Now it looks like something's going on down at the Tree of Life. There's a load of like, you know like the big boxes, like TV sets, TV crews. Akuna, tomato. <laughs> <laughs> so we just asked someone who was down there and they're filming the holiday special that's going to be on ABC which is of no use to us because we don't get that in the UK. Yay. The Fast Pass Plus is under the floating mountains so you have to cross the road where all the queue is to come and find it. Just here. You see all this? All the little lights on the uh, queue line are all ace themed. Honestly, like the whole thing in Pandora is so beautiful. Like the camera really does not do it justice. It's somewhere where you've definitely got to come and look at it all for yourself. All the cave paintings. Jimmy's been learning about cave paintings at school. Jimmy's happy he's not number nine again. You've all got them. <laughs> but don't worry, uh, they're very common around these parts. Uh, let's start the decon. Initiating GMR decon. Stay still over your number, you're not going to feel a thing. You're doing great. <laughs> all right, you've all been matched with avatars. As your children. Para su seguridad. Guys, I really liked it, and I got it. And it even it like just black and light, you know. And like you don't need a whole dog. You stroke your banshee. So where the screen used to be, just stroke it. You feel the banshee. <laughs> <laughs> that ride is awesome, and you notice more and more stuff. So the scene where you sort of pause for a little bit and look at all the glowing lights, you can hear like the banshee below you, which is really cool. That's when Jimmy will stroke it. Say, Mom, I'm stroking my banshee. I'm stroking it. That's really cute. You enjoy it, Jim. Yeah, it's really good again, yeah. If you're unlucky, it happened to me the first time and it's happened to Jim this time. They like really push the restraint in the back which can make it like a little bit hard to breathe but... Put your back into it, but yeah. Yeah, you can do it, put your back into it. This is $18, you can buy two for $30 but we only need one so we're just going to get the one. And Jimmy's also getting a banshee and you can pull its tail to make a noise and this is... $18 as well. So Jimmy can play with his personalised Navi character toy and he's got all of these so he can make a scene. You happy? Yeah. Got some good toys, haven't you? Yeah, and I think they're worth it, don't you? Oh yeah. It is now about 10 o'clock. So our next fast pass isn't until 12 o'clock for Expedition Everest. So our plan for now is we've seen uh, the gorilla trail, so we're going to go and look at uh, the gorillas, and then we're going to go for lunch. We think at Yak and Yeti, certainly not Harambe Market after the other day. And I love them ribs though. I know, but I think you're going to like what we're going to have from Yak and Yeti. We're going to do this Gorilla Falls Exp Exploration Trail, Gorilla Sanctuary. You want to go see some gorillas, dude? Yeah. Oh, eating the bugs. This looks pretty cool. I've been here, my friends. <laughs> you can hear him. I can hear puppies. Loads of them. We've spotted our first primate. It took me a while to see him. I was expecting a big gorilla. Three. Three. Oh, there's another one walking down. Oh, so cute. And, and it's a 
and they're all endangered. Jimmy likes learning about endangered animals. Which one's your favourite endangered animal? Penguins. Yeah, you learned a lot about pangolins, didn't you? Yeah. Hopefully then this class is an educational trip, so yeah. we won't get fined from the uh, local authority. <laughs> Yeah, we just send our vlogs into the teachers. <laughs> so they were Columbus monkeys that we saw. We've come to the research centre and there's a boa constrictor in here. But Jimmy's favourite is the flamboyant flower and beetle. It's that green beetle in there. Flamboyant though. That's quite cool. So coming out of the research centre you can get a bird spotting guide. Should we go and spot some? Is there any on the back? Oh, there's more. So we've just spotted a great blue turaco. What? You see it over there with the feathers on its head? Yeah, this is the great blue turaco. That's what I wanted to find. Are you happy? Yeah, that's okay. That's that it's a really funky one, isn't it? So we've just seen this one here with the yellow chest. So we're going to see if Jimmy can work out what it is. You worked it out already? So Jimmy spotted it before I could finish the sentence. What is it? It's the Tabitha Golden Weaver Plutus Connector Put Off. <laughs> and, then, and then with it, there's a the one that I think it. I brought spotted wood dough to the calabas. Oh yeah, that's joined to the other birds, isn't it? Yeah. Bird spotting. This is in the bird spotting section as well. But look at the colours of those fish. They look awesome, don't they? They'll be in Cooks of Dublin later. <laughs> Cooks of Dublin. <laughs> so I've learnt something new today, that um, grass is the main food for hippos. I thought they'd eat fish, I don't know why. Probably just because they're in the water a lot. We found a zebra. Zebra, zebra. Our zebra is black with white stripes or white with black stripes. What do you think their main colour is? Is he going to be a surprise? Go on, see what you think. Black. You think they're black with white stripes? Correct. Yeah. Well done. Because I looked on the zebra, yeah. and if you see, there's like a little bit of white on the black. Ah. Is or is it black on the white? We found the meerkats too. The airplane's scared of them. I didn't realise how quick a meerkat can run. When it's scared. Yeah. Or when it's two for one, make out movies, <laughs> make out meals. <laughs> Was that a dad joke? <laughs> See a whole group of them there. Gorilla's sleeping. But do you see up at the top, there's one eating some leaves as well. So that one will be dad because it's eating and the other one will be mum because it's sleeping. Let's see how Jimmy compares. Go compare. <laughs> Go compare. Getting all the comparison adverts today. So this is something me and Jim both agree on. That we've actually preferred this walk to the safari like ride. The, yeah, it's yeah. lovely. I would save a fast pass for something else and just come and do this walk instead. It's a lot more at your own pace and there's lots and lots of stuff to read and there's lots of seating as well as you go around. But this has been well worth it. Yeah, I've really enjoyed it. Very beautiful. I personally find like when we're on the safari, I always think that the nature reserve sometimes looks a little bit small. But here I think it looks absolutely stunning, doesn't it? Yeah. Looks like the animals have got plenty of room from what I've seen there. Really, really nice. Yeah, I've seen some good stuff. I'm really glad that we did that, but Jimmy's belly's rumbling now, so we're gonna go get him some food, aren't we? Yak and Yeti. It's another absolutely red hot day. We've come to Yak and Yeti and there's plenty of seating available today, which is good. I'm guessing it's because it's 10 to 11, so it's still pretty early for food. So Jim's queued up to get the food. We've got the table because Jimmy wants to look at his toys that he got from Pandora. And also my legs are in pain. Yeah, but I bet there won't be a pain when we get to the boneyard. Am I right? Probably, there might still be some. Uh, 
So we got Jimmy an adult quick service because I think he's really going to like this from what we had the other day. This is the honey sesame chicken from Yak and Yeti quick service. Me and Jim are going to share a honey sesame chicken and also a teriyaki beef which we haven't tried yet but it does look quite nice actually. Good. So guys, it's the end of the video, so please like, subscribe and you know, do all that good stuff and see you in the next one. Bye bye!